to be honest, that's utterly shameful because when the Kerala story came out, everyone pointed out this is not the real Kerala story. Kerala is a state of social harmony. It's a state of social harmony and coexistence. It is not a state that is some sort of mini Pakistan as the film tries to show. And yet the lies of this film are being officially circulated, an official broadcaster. It's truly disgusting. It's propaganda at its cheapest and worst. And I will say to you that as far as the country is concerned, uh, this is not at all something that anyone would admire or respect. And in Kerala, it's only going to create a backlash against the people who are spreading such vile falsehoods about our state. Do you think it's as part of election? Do you think it's, it's as part of election? I'm sorry, I didn't hear your question. Do you think it's part of a move from the... Oh, definitely, no question about it. We know that the autonomy of Rudashin is guaranteed under the Prasad Bharati Act, but the BJP government doesn't understand the meaning of autonomy. They have compromised the autonomy of every institution, including Rudashin. And this work is meant to serve purely the political interests of the ruling party. And people can see through that. Kerala are educated. They're not going to be easily fooled.